Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back for more. This guy three, Legend of the Super Delinquent. In the last episode, uh, we beat up a guy who had no friends. <laughs> In this episode, we are going to uh, continue tracking down Beryl and see what exactly is going on with her. Let's go. Sense of yearning. Oh, hey, we're in the senior rooms. Look, Yoko, th that's... Uh, I see it, Asuka. I had no idea that the one who our lady has a crush on is... Oh, you are so cute! I can't stand not hugging you! <laughs> <laughs> hey there, Sapphire. You just keep on being adorable. Just watch out for the teddy bear. I didn't really think. Huh? What an interesting group. Are you guys doing something fun? I want to join in. <gasps> huh? You guys? What are you all doing here? We were following you. So, this is where you had to be. You had to come see the princess. Yeah, so what? I, I I wanted to talk to her about something. Keeping a secret from us? M my lady, you and the princess truly are. Truly? You know, this isn't the first time the princess has hugged Miss Beryl. <laughs> yeah. Also, she and Almaz are kind of married at this point, and Beryl ought to know that. Besides, didn't you see? Although the princess was enjoying it, Miss Beryl didn't seem to be enjoying it at all. No. Although our lady seemed to not enjoy the embrace of Princess Sapphire, she must have secretly enjoyed it. That must be it! She may act hard on the outside, but she's soft on the inside. That's true, Almaz. And what do you mean she didn't enjoy it? Princess, I beg you, please don't make this any more complicated than it already is! Open your eyes, my lady. You forgot something that's really important. Miss Sapphire is a girl. This game was made in 2012. I don't know if that is entirely an issue anymore, pop culturally speaking. Oh well. <laughs> They're delinquents, I guess they're super conservative or something, I don't know. Shipping! I know that, duh! You knew? Yet you still love her? You don't mind having a girl as your partner? If that is the case, then why? Kyoko's voice actor, are you okay? You sound like you're losing your voice. Aww. Hey, this music is from Phantom Brave! What? That's not the point! This... this isn't right! We're always helping you to become a legendary delinquent! In order to do so, we thought that we needed to help you with your love, but... but... what you choose problem is, but if you don't like what's going on, I guess I'll just have to... I'll have to take on all your feelings at once! Bring it on! <laughs> My lady, you're doing all of this for us? Thank you. I don't know how to describe this feeling, but I'm going to bring my full strength. How did this happen? You're all delinquents! Can't we just talk this over? <laughs> Talking it over probably won't solve anything with Kyoko and Asuka. I shall side with Miss Barrel this time. Not you too, Princess. I've been feeling a little anxious too. Okay, servant, let's join this party! <laughs> I'm really getting tired of this. 
Fuel for the shipping fires. Let's go. Whoops. Alright, we have a level 150 barrel here and a level 150 sapphire. Plus a whole bunch of chickens and dragons and puppets for some reason. Excuse me. Watch close. We are going to leave Mao and Almaz out of this and just use the girls. It's funnier that way. <clears throat> I kind of wish they kept uh, Strange Wind playing during this the uh, during this map. That would have been neat. I like that song. Phantom Brave has a very nice soundtrack. Crane Dance! Can we do it? Good day! I mean, not that Crystal Rock isn't a pretty good song, too, but... I mean, I've been going through the class world all day. It's... I'm a little tired of hearing it at this point. <laughs> anyway, that sure was a map. Wow, you guys have gotten strong. All right, lost. What are you saying, my lady? We know your true powers. You took it easy on us. Uh, I didn't take it easy. I just couldn't use my full strength. I haven't gotten much sleep these last ten days. I just feel really, really tired. Aww. Lack of sleep? Then is that why you were acting so strange? You were just tired? Bummer. So it wasn't because you were lovesick. You tricked us! Lovesick? You're talking about me? What are you saying? That's like way out of left field. Yeah, they like each other. I've never even been in love. How can I be lovesick? But you were keeping your meeting with Princess Sapphire a secret. Not only that, but you were getting hugged so intensely, we thought that... No! I said I had to talk to her about something, right? That's right! It was such a cute thing to talk to me about that I couldn't stop myself from hugging you! Oh, that's why. So what did you two talk about? Did it have anything to do with your lack of sleep? Well, yeah. I wanted to keep it a surprise, but at this point it's probably impossible. It's okay, Miss Farrell. I wanted to celebrate with you, too, anyway. Celebrate? Everyone is so anxious. Make this announcement count. Now, Miss Barrel. Well, Kyoko, Asuka, come over here. since the three of us formed our group. That is a very long time to know each other. You guys have been helping me for a hundred years, and I really wanted to thank you, so I was asking the princess for advice. She told me that if I made a doll of each of you, you two would be happy, and they would make nice keepsakes. It took me ten sleepless nights, but this is my way of showing my gratitude. Do you guys accept? By the way, Miss Sparrow came to ask if these were good enough before giving them to you. And as you can see, they're extremely cute. I agree, Sapphire. I totally agree. They're adorable. My lady, you went to all this trouble just for us? 
Thank you so much. We are truly from the bottom of our hearts dying with happiness. I'm the one who should be giving thanks. You two, thanks for everything. I hope we'll always be together from now on, too. <gasps> Those, Those are, are our thoughts as well! well. My lady! Good job, Miss Beryl. Happy 100th anniversary! That was not what I was expecting. Stuffed dolls? That was dumb. Mal, aren't you glad? Miss Beryl wasn't lovesick. W what are you talking about? I thought I could unravel the mystery that is love. This was a waste of time. I'm going home. Well, well, well. As usual, Sir Mao wasn't being true to his feelings. Since I don't know what love is, in order for me to become a legendary delinquent, I gotta perform even more delinquent acts. The road to becoming a legendary delinquent is tough. So let's keep working together. Asuka, Kyoko? Of course, my lady! From this point on, no matter how tough the volunteer work may be, I can handle it. Till Our Lady becomes the legendary delinquent known all over school. No, all over the world. We will stay by Our Lady's side. Oh, hey, credits. Oh. That wasn't the credits. But hey, we got a... We got Hero Prinny and Mid Boss, which I guess we have to recruit. So, uh... That's what we'll be doing in the next episode. See y'all later, everyone. Bye bye That was a really short story. Just saying. <laughs>